when we talk about this, uh, you know, if you read Jeff, Ch <clears throat> Jeff Chang's chapter, you know, he talks about uh, Long Island, Long Island, as, uh, you know, uh, I believe he called the Black uh, Belt. Um, and, you know, Long Island is part of Queens, right? And so, you know, when you think of uh, boroughs in New York City, it's attached to, to Queens. And, um, you know, on the west part of Long Island is in Nassau County. Um, and then as you move out east, you get to like the Hamptons, okay? And the further east you get, the whiter and the richer it gets. The closer to Queens you are, you know what I'm saying, um, the blacker it is. And of, often, you know, less, less, less money. And the reason why we got to talk about L.I., you know, and L.I. has been a home to like crazy, crazy amounts of, you know, um, vicious racism. Um, it's also the place where the white flight you know, of the 60s in New York where the Irish and the Jews and the Italians, you know, left the Bronx, they ended up in Long Island. Um, and it's just a really important, you know, to, to talk about that because um, Long Island's an interesting you know, sort of cultural space, you know, um, you know, because it's, it, and it gave birth to so many, like, amazing, you know, Queens, Long Island, so many amazing hip-hop acts, De La Soul, uh, you know, Rakim, um, I mean, just countless acts, you know, but, um, yeah, you know, you think of Queens, which is where Run DMC is from, Hollis, Queens, you know, um, you know, it's more suburban, you know, a little more money, uh, public enemies from Long Island. Um, you know, people are, are more educated um, because there's more, you know, more money, more opportunity to go to college, etc. And we're talking black, white, um, you know, brown, um, you know, all the, all the all, all races are just, just a little more affluent out there. Not, not always the case, but again, as you get further east, you know, there's just more, 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 more money. Um, uh, but, you know, um, it's just an important place to talk about, you know, cause so many New York artists come from that. And again, like you look at someone like, you know, Chuck D, you know, his, or, 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 uh, Run DMC, you know, they had a, they didn't come from like the pretty extreme poverty, uh, and racism and, and classism experience that like the pioneering hip hop DJs uh, came up through. They they had more of a suburban middle class. Now I mean, listen, they dealt with <laughs> they dealt with plenty of of racism, but in, in in a different way. They had a house. Their their parents maybe both their parents had jobs and maybe a college education. They may have had a college education, um, etc there's still incredible racial tension on Long Island, but more opportunity, I think, um, for, for young black people um, in, in, that, in that area.